Welcome to Vouchers. Vouchers are simple text codes that customers can use in your online store to redeem discounts or other special offers. This is going to help your business or your email campaigns. Now, let's create vouchers. First, go to Import and create a new import. You can select Vouchers and either create a new project or select the one pre-created. So I'm simply going to type in Project. I'm going to go Next, name my import. And now you can select your data source. You can learn more about this step in our documentation about imports, but for now I'm simply going to upload a file from my computer. I'm going to select this one. And you can see that the file will give me discounts based on the things I just created and generated. If I go to my Excel sheet, you will simply see that I created a simple discount and randomized or any possible other um, voucher codes. This will allow me to now have my file format delimiter, which I can select based on what I have created, preview the data to see that it actually works, and click Next. In the data mapping step, you need to assign your code value to one of the columns. Simply drag and put it to the first name of this discount. So looking back to my Excel sheet, I'm going to start with the first row by naming what I'm actually talking about. Now, when everything is done and the code is tracked and you have your vouchers here, you're going to run your import. Success, it's working, everything is fine. Now, to actually access my vouchers, I'm going to go to Vouchers and Data Assets, and I can see that it's right here. I'm going to have to wait for it, but for now, I can actually see that in my Docs project, which I imported before, I have all of my voucher codes available. Now, when I'm going to send them through a scenario, email campaign, etc., I'm going to see that the people which we're going to redeem them are going to be tracked here on a specific time the same way as when I assigned them when I sent them. I can also import within that project by clicking import vouchers which will bring me to the step we had before. Note the last thing that you need to go to your settings, project settings, and go to mapping and then vouchers. Here you need to select an event, an attribute to define the usage of vouchers. You can learn much more about this in our documentation about vouchers, imports, and project settings. So this is vouchers. Mm -hmm.